did. I mortgaged my life, my love, my everything. For Vavivus, pleasure, for sex. Maybe ten. At most, twenty minutes has cost me nine years of my life. Nine years of love. Nine years. Down the drain. Just like that. Somebody should come and fill my heart and find reasons to capture the contest love. Inhale it and bring it to an abrupt end of its right of existence. The gift of love appreciates when it's lost. You wouldn't know whether to completely let it go or to go back and fight for the one you love which may not rightly belong to you but you fight because you don't want to let go I'm fine. Jade, why are you doing this to yourself? What is all this for God's sake? You think drinking yourself to death will solve anything? What will you have me do? Oh, tell me, mother, what will you have me do? What? I expect you to stand up. And take responsibility of your action. Chida Nechi! Laura. I expect you to forgive yourself. I expect you to forgive yourself by taking the blow by the home. Yes. The mother, my son, 
pronouncement. And Anastasia will not take my cause. What will you have me do? Can you sit down? No. I understand. You don't need to blame any of them. Even I, your mother, I'm highly disappointed at you. Yes, all these years. You didn't let me know. Please, mother. Do not condemn me. Bye. I've had just enough bread. I never knew she kept the beef. Oh yeah? Because you asked her to terminate it. Oh yeah? Chedi. You didn't think that your father would have loved to know he was expecting a castle. What will you have me do, mother? What will you have me do? How am I supposed to make things right? How am I supposed to make it? Chinelo, allow me to see my own son. How am I supposed to make Anastasia forgive me and come back to me? Tell me, mother. Should I don't know? But definitely, not stuffing yourself with alcohol. Not that! Go into the bathroom. Watch yourself. You will think of something. Go and shower. I'll come back and see you. I'm fine. That's what I'm Can I? Yes, ma'am. What's the handsome boy you are? Um, what can we do for you, ma'am? My daughter, I can't see you. We have something very important to discuss. Can I have a seat? Um, no problem. You can see it. Was never aware of all this until recently. A six years old grandson, I mean, should have come to me 
Yes, as a mother. I will know what to do. I came to the house once after I told him I was pregnant. But the gate man told me that Chidi ordered him not to allow me in. I also tried severally to reach out to you. But I was also denied access. So I, I just assumed that maybe that was your discussion with your son not to see me. No, not at all. I'm so, so sorry, my daughter. Very sorry. Okay? It wasn't easy. It was not easy at all. At some point, I even contemplated ending it all. But thank God for my mother. And this young man, my best friend, because they stood by me through it all. Nina, I'm truly sorry. Please, I'm begging you. I want to plead with you to find a place in your heart to forgive him. Be cool. Forgive him. There is nothing to forgive. Honestly, nothing. My dear, you have a lot to forgive. Yes, I know your heart, and justifiably so. I think Chede has realized his mistake. You need to see him now. He's emotionally wrecked. Because of them. I'm begging you. His fiancée has left him. He can't get access to his son. Because many are better. Please. He deserves it. He deserves it. He should be made to feel what it's like to be abandoned by that one person you really care about and love so much when you really need them. Please, madam. Please. I hope you're not here to ask me to forgive him. Though I bear him no grudge, I certainly do not want to see him. I don't want to see him. My dear, everybody deserves a second chance. She deserve a second chance. I'm begging you, my daughter. Please, forgive him. Before he dwells in this misery, because Help me save him. Just look at me. Me good man. I'm not getting any younger, as you can see. I need my grandson back. Please be good. Oh. <laughs> Wait. What do you people want for? What do you want me to do? Which grandson are you talking about? The same one he denied even before he was born? Which one? That he fertilized the egg doesn't make him a father.
Chidi's mother was here. Mm, what does she want? She came to beg on behalf of her son. <laughs> I... Do you know she didn't even know that Kanayo existed until recently? <laughs> May, he doesn't want you. I can't let go. But you have to forgive him. What about how I feel? Doesn't it count? It's easy to preach forgiveness, but hard to live by it. Chinuli, you have brought this pain for the past six years. But she this mom, getting to know that she has a grandson after all these years, must be hard on her. And I don't know how I will feel if I were in her shoes. It's not easy. Her son rejected my child. And that rejection shattered my life. Cost me everything. I lost everything. Everything. I'm not saying it was your fault that he rejected the child even while still in the room. But I can remember clearly. You to refuse to keep the child. Yes. It took you six years to accept that child as your son. What are you saying? Mama, what are you saying? Are you now taking sides with my enemies? No. Are you saying that I have an unforgiving spirit? Even when you know the gravity of the pain and the wound that rejection gave me? You must forgive. You will eventually forgive him. You have to let go. Forgive him and move on. When you forgive and move on, you release yourself from that emotional trauma. Forgive him. Oh. So, you want me to forgive him? Just like that? You want me to pretend and act as if nothing happened, right? No problem. No problem at all. Because that is exactly what I am doing. That is why I don't want to see him. That is why I want to forget him. That is why I want him to stay far, far away so that I don't remember what happened yesterday when I set my eyes on him. You have to let go. Oh, you must forgive him for the sake of your son and for you to move on. She release him, forgive him, move on. If you don't forgive him, you won't be able to move on. And when you release him from your mind, you you will be light. Blue yourself from that emotional stress. You know, go like a friend Anastasia will say. It's part of the healing process. No? No. No more. Forgive. You know, go. Forgive. Forgive you. Forgive and let go. You find that you move on. You know, go. To you. Let's go. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You know, go. No. It's okay. It's okay. Go. I'm <laughs> 
Good evening, Mom. Good evening. How did it go? Sit down. Sit down. Not good at all. Not good. I didn't find her in the house. My neighbors told me she has not been home for days now. And she's not taking my calls. I'm tired of all this. I'm tired. It's okay. Take it easy on yourself, okay? Mama, I've tried. I've tried. Did you go to see Chinilo? Yes, I did. How did it go? Chili. That girl is too angry with you. How did you manage to shatter her heart into a thousand pieces? I trained you on how to respect women, didn't I? I'm sorry, Mom. I'm so sorry. I just don't know how I got myself into this mess. But I know somehow the past will always come knocking. Children, you have to make things right. Yes. Not just for the sake of your son, but because it is the right thing to do. Okay? You have to go and seek for that girl's forgiveness. Let her forgive you first. All that things can follow. Right? It's okay. Cheryl, I said it's okay. Don't you trust your mom again? I do. I do. Come down, okay? I need to be with my son now. You should leave. Not until you tell him that I am his father. Who gave you that nerve to walk into this house and refer to yourself as his father? I said, I don't understand. How? What right? What right do you have to refer to him as your son? What right? She I know I messed up. I know I wronged you. And you have every right to be mad at me. Let's go on. All I'm asking is for a chance to make things right. A chance to make up for all the years that I have been absent. A chance to be part of my own son's life. A chance. <laughs> I know you are a woman with a beautiful soul. And I can see you struggling with yourself. But deep down, you know that this is the right thing to do. That boy deserves a better life. We need to secure his future. We need to do Everything right for him. Boys, just 
slow down. Okay? Slow down because you are not in a position to tell me what is right and what is not right here. Yes. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry for treating you wrong. You do not deserve the way I treated you. I was selfish. And I'm sorry about that. Please, forgive me. That boy deserves a better life. Let us move, a move ahead of all this. Please, I beg you. Change But you can't change the fact that she is connected. I am sorry. From the depths of my heart, I beg you. Forgive me. Forgive me. Be focused in life. Just be strong. If I'm a lame girl, God knows the best. If I'm a lame girl, she don't be here come mama. I'm the nakachubu, I'm the nakachubu kero wa, I'm the nakachubu. If I'm a lame girl, I'm the nakachubu. Andi naka chupu kero Andi naka chupu Andi naka chupu Andi naka chupu kero Andi naka chupu Andi naka chupu Andi naka chupu kero Andi naka chupu Too much, we saw. Will it you bring him home? Or oh, just for a few hours? <laughs> Look at my lovely grandson. How are you? I'm fine, yeah. You can call me grandma. Is he grandma? You call him handsome. Just like his father. Like father, like son. <laughs> so, how did she let you take him home? I hope you both had an agreement. Hey, come on, Mom. Of course, you know I wouldn't bring him back home without proper arrangement. Okay. I knew that. So tell me, are you too good now? I'm not sure about that yet. But I know he will bring us back together. I'm happy for you, son. Come, 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 come. I know you are scared. But you don't need to worry about him. I never thought a day like this would come. And honestly, I, I am not prepared for it at all. But then, you are not prepared for a lot of things. But somehow, we adapt. Are you sure I am doing the right thing? Yes, of course. And Naya needs his father as much as he needs his mother. I know you are scared Chidi might not be the right kind of father for him. But in my opinion, Chidi has done a lot of growing up these past years. Hmm? You don't need to worry. All you have to do is trust him. Oh. I, I honestly wish I could stop worrying. But I, I, I can't. You have to. 
and I think he still likes you. Hmm? I saw the way he was looking at you. Mama, please stop putting ideas in your head. Chili is in the past, please. I hear. Can everything just get back to normal, please? But I thought you said you've forgiven me. Then why? I am not going with you, period. Oh. Listen, I, 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 don't, I don't... Just... Look who we have here. Son. Big man. I hope you're ready for me. Yes, sir. Let's go, okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's leave. Huh? Take good care of yourself. Okay, my love. Okay. All right, time to leave. <laughs> take care of yourself, my love. Of course, I will take care of myself. I wasn't talking to you, I was referring to my son. Bye, mom. Bye, I want you to wait for me by the car, okay? Okay, Dad. Yeah. Hey, um, listen. I want you to do me a favor. What thing? I want you to help me talk to Anastasia. I know that you're talking with Anastasia. Please help me tell her to come home. Tell her to take my calls. Some wounds really take time to heal. Especially wounds that are inflicted by men like you. Please, take good care of my son for me. And don't teach him how to be selfish. Please.
fridge. Or don't you like the fridge? Is there a problem, boy? Hmm? Talk to them. It's, it's, it's a nice meal. You should try it. Yeah. Listen, if you don't like this one, you tell me what you want, I'll go get it. Hey, why are you crying? What is it? What is, what, what, what's the problem? I want my mommy. <laughs> And why don't you want to go with me? Mama, I cannot believe you're asking me that question. It's just for a few days. Ah. Mama, please, I cannot go there. He is still the father of your son. This whole thing is still amazing for your son. He doesn't understand what is going on. You need to help him ease into his new life because that is where he belongs. And besides, traditionally, we cannot withhold him from being with his father. Mama, please stop trying to convince me. If there's anybody that belongs there, it is my son. So let him learn how to get used to his new house. That is his fate. We all have our crosses to bear. Ha, I know. But you have to help him. I don't have to do anything. Besides, if he wants to come to the house to see his son, He's always free to do so. Nobody will stop him. In fact, Mama, Biko, I, I, I don't want to continue this conversation again. I suppose he travels out with your son to a faraway place where you can never see him again. She didn't agree to come with you? Yes. I knew it's going to be difficult for her to agree. But don't give up son. Keep trying, okay? Okay? I just want my son to be comfortable around me. To see me as his father. Is that too difficult to ask? Don't son. Let us hope she will be convinced and comes back and stay with us now. Oh, mommy. She insists I come over to her house to see him every day. How is I supposed to get used to me as his father? It's not enough to say hey. Now your dad is your father. I want him to see me as one. He will. Just a matter of time. Oh. Time. How much time? How long am I supposed to wait? This is more difficult than I thought. Okay, let's give her some time. Mom? Have you taken anything? Mom? 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 
we expecting somebody else? Uh, um, no, no. I, I, I'm, I'm happy to see you. She's welcome. Um, uh, you did not call to Kai. What's happening? Mom, the Kai is at the mechanic. Oh. Good afternoon. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Why are you just staring? You're not even hugging me and, and stuff. Oh, oh hey. Hi. I miss you. I miss you too. Thank you very much for coming back. Okay? <coughs> hey, hey, hey. Um, now you're here. It's time to eat lunch, so? So I came at the right time. Mm -hmm. Let's go there. <laughs> so I'll just go freshen up. Okay. And I missed your cuisine. Um, yes, Mom. Thank you very much for coming back. It was a mess in your absence. I'm glad I came back. Thank you. Because I thought about it and I realized trust is always going to be an issue. But to be quite hard for I won't forget. I've just decided to put everything behind me. Hello, brother. Right now? Right. I must tell you now. So, at this job job, I like to say, it's just your first start. Wow. We'll do drinks later. So, <laughs> so press that. 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 Just like my dog. <laughs> 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 I couldn't bear the emptiness of day without you. I waited for you for so long. And now you're here and it feels like you're not here. I miss you so much, baby. Are you okay?
I think I like this one. Why? Uh huh. For sure, all the cards, huh? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Hey, my boy. How are you? How are you? You're welcome. Ah. That thing is cold. Okay. Hey, boy. How are you? I'm fine, Dad. Of course, you look fine. Thank you, Dad. I'll say hi to your grandmother. Good afternoon, Dad. Good afternoon, Good afternoon, Good afternoon, Good afternoon, Thank you so much. You've made my day. <laughs> no. Um, good afternoon, Dad. Good afternoon, Dad. It's so good to see you. So good to see you, too. <laughs> I didn't know you came out. Um, my bad. I was planning to come see you later this evening, so we'll talk some things over. Oh, really? Hey. Thank you. Hey, Sam. Um, why don't you come with Daddy so I'll show you to your room? Okay, Dad. Get. Let's go. What's mom is coming with me? Uh, so, um, I've been wondering why you haven't been coming to see me. so very good. So many. Look good. I like your hair. You're blown too. Really? <laughs> yes. Wow. I don't need to say that to you because you get it all the time. Mm. You're doing great, and I'm so <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, you're doing great, and I'm so proud of you. Thank you. So, Chinelo, hi, Simon. She's fine. Um, thank you for coming, okay? Hey, you said you wanted to see me. What's going on? How? You mean Nelo and Nayo? Yes. Listen, I just want you, my son. Okay? I'm wasting in this game. Well, that is because it is the only reason why Nayo has agreed to stay with me comfortably. Comfortably, huh? Okay. It's just for a few days. Okay? Listen. You have nothing to worry about. It is you that I want to spend the rest of my life with. Huh? Fine, it's okay, you don't have to explain. You know I always trust me to support you. I'm so sorry I blanked out for this while. I just needed time to clean my sleep. I'm just glad you're both back together. Like, I, I wouldn't have imagined me being the cause of your breakup. And there's no way I would have forgiven myself if you did not come back together with him. It's not your fault. And I'm so happy things are working out between you both now. <laughs> well, it has to be that way for the sake of our son. We mustn't be friends again. The way he hugged you, oh please, he was just carried away. He didn't think I would come. Mm. <laughs> Listen, there's nothing there. When you break a rope and tie it back together, the length shortens. It's never the same again. I get your point. And I'm so happy for this new you. And you're radiating and I'm just, I'm just happy you found yourself again. Thank you. And I owe you all the appreciation. Thank you so much. And I hope someday you'll find a man that will love you just the way you are. Ah, please. Finding a man is the least of my problems right now. 
I just want to go back to school and achieve my dreams. Mm. Besides, there's no reason for marriage is to have children. I already have one, so I don't think men should be my problem right now. Don't worry. You can achieve anything you set your mind to achieve. Always remember that. Thank you so much. I really appreciate everything. Thank you. Thank you for forgiving my baby. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. This food is delicious. Mm. Thank you. Demand that you will be a lucky man. So am I right? Oh, oh yes, mother. The food is a blast. Mm -hmm. Tune in, you're right. The food is quite tasty. <laughs> you have to teach me how to make some of these things. We're so engrossed with these skills in the UK that. I doubt if I can remember any recipe at all. <laughs> I'm so engrossed with busy schedules in the UK that I barely remember any recipe at all. <laughs> so how then do you eat? Restaurant. Oh. Or we order for food. I mean, gone are the days when cooking in the kitchen is a must in every woman to do this. <laughs> it's okay. Whenever you're ready, I'll teach you how to cook any food of your choice. I trust you. <laughs> now you like your food? Yeah, I like it. You like it? I like it. I can see that. That's my glory. Is it good? Yes, I'm fine. Okay. You did. Mm. Need some help? Uh, no, 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 don't. Thank you very much. I'm really sorry. I'm so. Please. So, so please, sorry. Can, can you stop apologizing? It's actually taking us back. Please. The idea is for us to forget. And if you keep apologizing, we can't do that. Apologies only redress the issue. It doesn't heal it. So please just stop. Stop. How do I make things right again? You're already doing that. You're becoming a good father to my son. What more can I ask for? You know, my mother was right. She said, any man who loves you will be the luckiest man in life. You know, my mother was right. She said, any man who ends up with you will be the luckiest man in it. You didn't have this sentiment years ago. I'm, 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 please, please, I'm, uh, just tone it down, I mean, these words of yours are making me uncomfortable. I guess I was stupid back then. Yes, you were. But 
I forgive you. You're really making me uncomfortable. Baby. You're here. Oh, oh yes. Uh, you see, I... I came to make sure she's comfortable with us. Mommy, I am fine. Oh, she's fine. She's fine. Great. Chinebo, how about a quick tutorial? Uh, I'll just, I'll just leave you to it. Right. <laughs> What are you talking about, darling? I'm saying I'm getting really uncomfortable with me. You're engrossed with this whole chinny thing. Babe. Don't talk like that. Okay? You see, um, I'm just worried that she reminds me of the past so much. Let the past be the past. I let the present tarry. No, my mom is looking for you. What? Only two days. I know, but it's better for me to leave. The agreement was for me to stay a few days, and I have tried. Two days is enough. Chinelo, is there a problem? You know, we can always talk about it. No, there's no problem. I'm not doing anything here, so it's better for me to leave. Imana is sleeping. He can spend the night here, then I'll be here tomorrow to pick him up if the need arises. <laughs> You're here as well, and you know he's so fond of you, so I'm very sure you can manage without me. But, Chinelo, that was not the agreement. Please, can we not argue about this now? Let's not just argue. Uh, no. Thank you. Thank you for your hospitality. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Okay. And please, take care of my canary. Please. Sure, trust me, I will. And I'll come see you later, so we'll talk. Oh, that will be fine. No problem. Take care of yourself, okay? Okay. Um, Chile. My request to your mom. Do take care of yourself, okay? Bye. Bye. Hey, 
it's okay. Everything's going to be fine, okay? I'm fine. You're not cold. Say it like that. She doesn't know you to make me for nine years. Listen, I am not worried about her. Okay? I'm just worried I might not be able to spend enough time with my son. God, I'm going to be my life. Babe. Why are we even having this conversation? She decided to leave. I didn't ask her to go. Well, could you say so? Come. Tell It is you I love. It is you I want to spend forever with. So as long as I have you, and I have access to my son, then I'm fine. Okay? Fine. I don't doubt you. I trust you and you know you always have my support and trust. Thank you. Mama, good afternoon. What happened? You are home early. And where is Anna? He's still with his father. How do you mean? What's no problem? No. I just became uncomfortable, so I had to leave. What do you mean, became uncomfortable? Uh, Mama, can I know it's fine. It's fine. Shining. 
Forget the way. It's your cool. Ah, forget that, you know. They wanted to finish me with so much exercise. Hmm. I'm telling you, you need to have seen how that can be so tedious, so much work. But you don't look like you're about to die. Eh. No. Instead, you're glowing. Really? Shining. Hey, oh. one them 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 <laughs> What is the secret? It's just God, though. Ah. And it's a whole lot of mm -mm. exercise. I like on a monachuku. <laughs> Everybody, just God, though. That is what I hear all the time. It's just God though. It's just God though. <laughs> Even when they steal, it's just God though. Please tell me your secret, John. No, I do not have any secret. Believe me. But I think it's just all about my body, my gym. Chai. Yes. Chai. Wait a minute. Where is Nayo? I really missed him. Mm. Nayo is with his father. His father? <laughs> My friend, I have plenty gist for you. As in, plenty gist. Sit down, sit down. <laughs> sit down. <laughs> A lot has happened. <laughs> A lot has happened. <laughs> <laughs> Biku, 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 just go ahead. My ears are itching already. <laughs> I can't wait to hear the gist. The summary of the whole thing is that Chidi is back. <laughs> Chidi. Your chidi. No, 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 no. He's not my chidi. He's just the father of my child. But we get along very well now. Ooh. When you say you get along well, does that mean you both are back together? <laughs> no, not that too. And it can't even happen. We're just two individuals that have something in common. Same parents. Different people. Really? Hmm. It was not easy. Initially, I will not lie. Hmm. It was not easy at all. But I realized that he's really sorry for what he did. So I decided to forgive him so me too I can have my peace of mind. <laughs> ah. So in other words, you guys are back together. Don't put words into my mouth. You see, you why not? Hey. It can't even happen. Because he has someone else he wants to marry. And you know her. <laughs> Who? Anastasia. Wait a minute. Wait. Anastasia that... Exactly. And apparently, they have been together for nine years. Hey, whoa. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Why are men like this? Why days? In other words, they were actually dating and he came down here to mess around with you. Exactly. But it's all in the past now. I mean, last, last. We are, we are alright, you know, um, it's, it's fine. Yeah. We are alright, very, very alright. <laughs> yeah, right. So, yeah, let me ask you now. If Chidi had asked for you both to come back together, as, you know, lovers, you know, would you accept? Uh, did you buy tiger nuts for me from the nuts? Chinelo, answer my question. I bought... A Kelsa, I bought Kili. Hey, hey. I bought now you're talking. Now you're talking. I to I Hmm. Okay. Darling. Mm hmm We have been together for years now. I couldn't have asked for a better companion than you. So now... I 
think it is time to seal our union. <laughs> Anastasia, I love you so much. I want to spend forever with you. I want to wake up next year. <laughs> All the days of my life. I want to be beautiful kids with you. So I beg you. Please. Be my wife. Let us grow old together. What is he doing here? Exactly. Why are we here? Chinelo. I know you never stopped loving Chile. And Chile, even though you don't want to admit it. You're falling in love with Chinedo, knowing she has your son. What are you talking about? What's going on here? I see the way you both stare at each other. You call out her name in your sleep. You are brightened up the moment her name is mentioned. And you are mistaken. You are mistaken. I know you want to marry me because you think we've been together for so many years. And leaving me to marry another would be wrong. What are you saying? Girl, what is going on? Exactly. What are you saying? I'm 
this early. Trust me, this is harder than you think. I could go ahead and accept your proposal, but what benefit will it be to me knowing that I'm marrying someone whose heart belongs to another? Um. We find love in unexpected places and people. And sometimes we don't have control over the issues of the heart. I love you, Donald. I love you too, baby. But I have to let go. I can't let you make another mistake simply because you want to make me feel better. I need your purpose. Uh, Please. Not only do I know that you love him, but I also know that you trust my judgment. And in all sincerity, I love to see you both do forever. If you really have the interest of Kanayo at heart, And I know marrying him will be one of your dreams come true. I should have done that. I should have 